Congressman Tim Hulskamp, uh, Congressman, Republican Congressman from Kansas, tweeted, Obama politicizes the military to end his speech. Totally expected, Mr. President. Things How are not did the going president well, win against the military? Well, it's pretty clear. He wanted to bring the troops home. He wants to close Gitmo. <laughs> he wants to do all kinds of things. Talking about the thing that you tweeted immediately thereafter, three minutes later, you said, was there a diplomat in Benghazi that gave oh. his life for his country, Mr. President? And I think if you would stop being a cheerleader and be a journalist, you'd recognize we're not getting those answers. Did you just call me a cheerleader? <laughs> I, I don't know. Maybe you have that history. I'm saying no, look wait, at the wait, facts wait. No, of the hold matter. On, hold on, hold on. Did, I'm wait, saying you're a cheerleader on. for the administration. Okay, so I'm you're a cheerleader? You're not being a journalist when you're not willing to look at the facts. If it was Bush, you would be jumping and screaming. You're amazing. Because it's Hillary Clinton. Whenever and wherever I can, I will act without constraints. Lawless. The new imperial presidency, Obama will do everything without legislation to advance really his radical think he agenda. Yes, you his deleted classroom. Article 1. When you exactly. tweeted that the president is hail to the king, Obama to unleash the imperial presidency. Well, does. What did he say in the speech that was lawless tonight? 14 different points in where the president said, I don't like the American people who they elect. Tonight, and your arguments here Enjoy uh, are from two totally Enjoy different him. universes. The president's speech fell flat out in the real world. In Washington, there's still a Twitter, but recognize. Well, I found you spectacularly disingenuous in explaining your own words tonight, but I hope you'd come on my show and we could have this conversation one-on-one -on -one sometime soon. Uh,